biblical moral values and requires all adult members to agree with and sign our, as are the assumptions of a Christian worldview throughout the entire program. However, the, the program is designed in baseball, hot dogs, apple pie, and Boy Scouts. That's like the American foundation that our society was built on, were those quality institutions. And it's, it just goes along with the American way. I mean, that's what it, where we came from. But it's not where I want to go any longer because they've changed the foundation that they're built on. We got the shirt, the hat, the pants. There's a couple patches and things that are coming out. because the changes that they're making are gonna be detrimental and hurtful to the youth of our nation, especially the young men that we're trying to raise up as quality individuals that could lead, become great fathers, great politicians, great teachers, great pastors, great men in society. If we let the poisons of this, of the homosexual and lesbian agenda start to pervert our nation's youth and try to make something that's abnormal normal, to change something that's wrong into right, then it's gonna poison and destroy that organization to the point that it's not like even gonna be recognizable to the founders of Boy Scouts. If they were alive today, they probably wouldn't say, oh my gosh, 10 years from now, I can't even recognize what the Boy Scouts are because that's not what we started. But one of my employees that used to work for me that if their leaders are saying it's okay to be homosexual, and in my opinion, it, it's a perverse way of looking at, at existing as a human being, it's twisting what is natural to become unnatural, then you're gonna be teaching these young impressionable people that something that is unnatural is natural, and it isn't. And I don't want to confuse my son, and I don't want to damage our society to raise a whole group of young people thinking that homosexuality is a good thing for society.